You know, it's so easy to feel like a misfit and feel lonely as a kid, regardless of what background you come from. You know, I definitely felt like a misfit. You know, I was coming from two different cultures, not only that, but I was also like eccentric, I guess, in class. Like I would, if we had a chance to read the textbook, I would get so excited and my friends would be like, why is she reading social studies in a British accent? Like, this isn't even necessary. And I'd be like, I don't know, it's fun. <laughs> My name is Sahana Srinivasan. I'm an actress, a filmmaker, writer, and the host of Brain Chat. I definitely, as a child, I definitely loved being in the center of attention. Uh, whenever my parents would take home videos of my sister and I, I loved being in the, in the spotlight. I loved hogging the camera. I like to make people laugh, I think. Um, makes me feel good, you know life is already so busy and, and crazy and chaotic and to just take a break and, and watch, you know, a, a comedic play or stand up or something, it's, it, it's really, you know, nice. I auditioned for Brainchild fall of 2017. I sent in a tape, basically, it sort of looked like a vlog, I guess. I set it up on my desk and I sat in my little rolly chair and had on this shirt with a bunch of fish on it, I guess. I thought that was the vibe that they were going for, I guess. Surprise? Fear? <gasps> Disgust? Ugh, oh, gross, quinoa. When I got that call, you know, that I sang from my agent saying that I had booked the project, I didn't expect it at all, especially because I was also working on, on school, too. My mind was in all over the place. The reason why it's exciting, I think, to watch the show and to watch me engage, you know, in these experiments is that the reactions are genuine. It's like the audience is learning with me. That's why I think it comes across as very accessible and relatable and not at all portraying the content in a complicated way. There has been this representation issue of having um, people of color as the lead role. You know, in the past, growing up, for me, I, I saw a lot of stereotyping. This show definitely doesn't do that. It's, it's really just me, and I'm complicated and much more than just an Indian person or a woman. The thing that stands out more is that I'm quirky or funny or, you know, um, unpredictable or whatever. That stands out much more than my background. It's cool to see that on screen and it not being talked about at all, you know, in a positive or negative way. That's real life. People are different everywhere and it doesn't have to be this big deal. If you're a young girl and you want to go into a field that you're afraid of or you think you don't have what it takes, chances are, I mean, the fact that you're so passionate about it says something about you already, but if you don't think you have the skill set that's required, then you can always learn, you know? And I think we fear like making mistakes because you have to make so many mistakes at the beginning in order to get better. Do that, you know? Go through that phase of like falling many times. And then eventually you'll feel like, okay, I do have what it takes. Obviously like failing is not doing bad in that field, it's just not even trying at all. You have to try.